Hi YouTube land! Hi friends! Who finally what's up with my hair? But anyways, finally I get to make a review on these products just because I consume too much of them or I've been using them for like over a year or let's just say two years. Yeah, because I started using this when my key was like two three months old now he's 14 months so i've been using this for like a year and i consume already two okay so what i'm talking about is this lush product which is handmade handmade cosmetics in facial moist moisturizer i have the skin shangri -La. this one um retails of uh, 49 dollars to 50 dollars so with tax and everything maybe like 54 to 55 dollars depending on where you at but this is oh, where's the size okay 45 grams or 1.5 ounce over there so yeah, this is a skin moisturizer, but for me, it should be facial cream because it's really thick. But I would say for this price, I know it's kind of pricey for like $50, $55, but I'm telling you guys, it's all worth it. And this one, I used it for like, you know, four to six months. Yeah, that's why I, you know, used two packages within a year so that's like five six months to use this one and i can say that the first time i used this one for you know a first two weeks i didn't like the smell because i am not used to the smell of grassy smell or uh what you call it like uh you know like grassy smell whatever they put in here like vegetables or flowers or seeds you know i'm just not used to that and this is my last container but wow this is just like one application which i have in here but i already already reorder online and i i hope i can also try their gorgeous because i've heard so much about that i heard it's thicker than the skin shangri-las this one is amazing if you have a dry skin this one it stays on my on my skin on my face overnight until you know like the next day i sleep more than 10 hours and this one stays on my skin maybe depending on how you sleep i sleep on my side and sometimes i just sleep on my back that's probably why i'm not rubbing it up on my pillow but yeah that product stays really long and another one that i want to make a review is their skin drink it's also a facial moisturizer it's a little bit this one i would say it's you know like uh, um thinner than the skin shangri-la it's like lotion and this one is also the same size 45 grams and uh it's have a price i think this one is 24 25 dollars so it's have a price of the skin shangri-la and what i can say about the this product i opened this like let's just say four or five months ago and look i know i'm still halfway just because i don't really like this one i don't like the smell i don't like the texture i don't like how it feels on my skin i don't know why is that but i am not buying this anymore though it's you know like half cheaper than the uh, skin shangri-la it's not worth it because i don't like the smell i don't like everything about it but it's it's up to you guys if you're liking this one good for you but i think this one is not for me because i have a drier skin so i need something like thicker than this one and also i don't like the smell but for now i am using it on my elbow on my knees and on my feet just because i have 
dry feet so this one you know like good for my feet just because I won't be able to smell it I don't like the smell but this is better than the regular lotion because it stays on longer than the regular lotion so it's up to you guys but this one is not for me it's the skin drink so yeah blah 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 and just because I ran out of skin Shangri-La I went you know like looking around here but there is no lush store closer to my place that's why i order online but we went to santana a couple days ago and i saw this uh place where they sell a hundred percent uh organic uh skincare products which is this one 100 pure i know i am always getting sucked with all this pure words and organic and whatsoever so I bought their uh, super fruit night balm so I already asked the girl what's the difference between uh, facial moisturizer to facial cream to uh, you know facial or night balm so she already explained it to me night balm is more thicker than the cream and so I wanted to try this one it's the age corrective one because I am old already. I need this. So I wanted to try it. I haven't tried any of their product. When I went there, they have buy three, get one free. But I didn't buy that promotion just because I haven't, like what I said, I haven't tried any of their products. But I did like one of their uh, body scrub. But right now, I still have a lot of body scrub in here. That's why I didn't buy. But it's the coffee cocoa butter scrub so yeah this one is $32 so I paid $34.80 right there and this is cruelty free gluten free and it comes in this you know like fabulous packaging and I tried it already i've been using it or applying it for like four nights already and i love the smell it's a fruity smell i also like the packaging and the product itself just because when you travel a lot this is a friendly traveler or friendly travel i don't know how you say it so just because it's a balm it's not a cream that it's good like it could be like slopping all over the container but this one stays on just because it's a balm just like the lip balm and like what i said i love the smell and this is 1.2 ounce so the lash is much bigger than this one but i like the packaging but so far what i can say about this product is not really hydrating my skin not like the skin shangri-la's uh lush uh facial moisturizer i don't know and also this one it's a little bit like grainy when you feel it but the, the sales lady already told me that it's a little bit grainy but once you apply it on your skin it melts so it melts but we'll see how it is because i just started using it but right now like what i said it's not really hydrating my skin it doesn't stay you know all night on my skin but it promised to like beautify you while you're sleeping blah 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 but we'll see and i can't wait to you know like receive my new skin shangri-la and maybe the gorgeous we'll see about it so that's my verdict on these products it's up to you guys if you want to try it this is my opinion just because it's my skin and it's me who uses the products so you know like that is my review depends on you know like how it you know 
how it performs on my skin so yeah thank you for taking your time watching my video i'll see you guys on my next and don't forget to watch my exercise routine to get uh you know like firmer um you know like firmer arms smaller flatter abs belly but yeah i just want to share you guys what i've been up to i exercise a lot I still eat a lot because I don't want to, you know, look like sick, losing weight, but look like sick. You know what I mean? Because I've seen a lot of girls like, uh, she lost weight, but she doesn't look healthy just because they starve themselves. I don't know why, but yeah, you gotta sweat it out, girl. Bye. Look at the wrinkles, wrinkles. Bye.